Celebrity nutritionist Karina Heinrich is back. Today, she's putting her best-selling Karina Method recipe guide to good use with the help of her children, Landon and Skye. They're in the kitchen to show us how to make healthier Thanksgiving side dishes for your family feast. Today, Landon, Skye, and I are gonna walk you through our favorite holiday recipes. Healthy eating doesn't mean you have to give up on your holiday favorites. All you need is a few modifications. Instead of butter, you can use mashed bananas, applesauce, pumpkin puree, herbs, and spices and olive oil. Instead of sugar, you can use vanilla extract, almond extract, peppermint extract, and cinnamon. You want to keep sides super veggie heavy and really simple to ensure you're getting nutrients in first. Roasted asparagus can be beautiful on its own and roasted carrots or sweet potatoes, really rich in taste and a bright pop of color. One of our family favorites is the Karina Method Winter Squash and Sweet Potato Medley. We just got done cubing butternut squash, acorn squash, and sweet potatoes. So Landon, I want you to take this brush and lightly coat it with olive oil. That way you can control how much olive oil is going on your veggies. Another favorite is our roasted Brussels sprouts with pumpkin seeds. So we just got finished roasting our Brussels sprouts and I'm gonna have Skye drizzle on a little bit of maple syrup. There you go. And then sprinkle on pumpkin seeds. These are two extremely easy to make, but very delicious side dishes that will be such crowd pleasers. What about dessert? Don't worry, Sky. I have you covered. Let's teach everyone how to make the Karina Method peanut butter bites. We're going to teach you how to make a dessert that is high in protein, fiber, and low in sugar. But they're really yummy. They are so yummy, and they're no bake, and the peanut butter bites are amazing because you can sneak in a lot of healthy ingredients. You can also use a nut butter that is nut free if you have allergies in the house. So let's get started by pouring in all of our ingredients, you guys. So first, mommy's gonna start with half a cup of chunky peanut butter. And if you can use organic, that is always best. Next, Landon, you can pour in half a cup of mini carobs or you can use mini chocolate chips. So pour those in. All of them? Uh, all of them in. Scott, you wanna pour in one cup of old-fashioned oats and you can use gluten-free oats if you wanna make this gluten-free. Next, we're gonna pour in one tablespoon of chia seeds, which is right there, Sky. Landon, you can pour in one teaspoon of vanilla. Makes it a little sweet, but naturally. And then, Sky, you can add in half a cup of ground flax seeds. So there's all your fiber and protein. And last, mom is gonna pour in one third cup of honey. I like to use Manuka honey because of all of the added antioxidants. So all you have to do, this is how easy it is, we're gonna mix up all of our ingredients and you can use a mixer or do it by hand like we do to make it really easy. Sometimes it's a little messy and you sneak in the chocolate chips that fly out of the bowl. Once it's all mixed up, you can put it in the refrigerator for about 15 minutes to kind of firm it up so it's easier to scoop. But for TV's sake, we're gonna show you how we scoop it into little portion sizes and then it ends up like this. These can be stored in your fridge for up to a week. Freeze it like we do and take it out as needed, but these are the ultimate snack, ultimate dessert. Would you like to try one? Yummy! We hope that you have a wonderful holiday season. Can't wait to see you soon. Happy holidays, guys. And happy holidays to you too, Heinrich family. Those peanut butter bites look delicious. You will always teach me so much during your segments. To learn more about Karina Heinrich, visit thekarinamethod.com to download the Karina Method recipes or sign up to work on your nutrition one-on-one -on -one with Karina.